today I'm going to be using the Josie Marin Argon Daily Moisturizer. This has SPF of 47 and it has a tint to it as well. It's really good for your skin. So I'm going to apply this one all over my face. So my brows are already done. I used the Too Faced Chocolate Brownie Pencil in the shade Dark Brown and I used Essence Brow Gel as well. This is by Nip and Fab Smooth. It's a serum, so it says that you can actually add it to your moisturizer serum or you can use it as a night treatment for a blurring effect or you can actually apply it directly to skin as targeted concentrate. So I'm going to do that today. I'm going to use it as a primer. It comes in a dropper and it's pretty thick. So I'm just going to take a little drop to start with. I haven't used this one before, so it'll be interesting to see. Smells good. I'm just gonna take another drop. I'm gonna use some lip balm, and this is by Arbon Liquid Sunshine. It has SPF of 15, which I do really love to apply this one before I go in the sun. So I'm gonna be using Fenty Beauty Foundation, and this is in the shade 120. Uh, it's a bit dark, but I think I do have a little bit of a fake tan going on, so I think it will match me. Oh, sorry, it's 210, not 120. 210, it's called the Pro Filter Soft Matte Longwear Foundation. It says shake well on the bottle. I'm gonna start with that. I'm gonna apply it in the center of my face and then work it outward. I've been loving this concealer lately guys like I've been using it non-stop this is the double wear by Estee Lauder and this is in the shade 2 W light medium warm and this has a warm tone to it it's really nice on the skin I really love it people say it's heavy under the eyes but I don't find it heavy so what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna hide my dark circles and I'm gonna just brighten my inner corners as well with this and I'm not gonna take it anywhere else I'm just gonna blend that concealer I really love to use cream contours and cream bronzer during the summertime, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna use my Chanel bronzer. Uh, it's a cream bronzer. I really like this. Um, so I'm just gonna use the same uh, foundation brush I used. So I'm gonna use this all over my face just to give me some warmth. So I always do my creams before I do any powder, just to kind of avoid that, you know, cakiness. Uh, so I'm using the Kevin Aquan, the Liquid Contour Wand, and this is in the shade Medium. Uh, it's a clicky pen, it has a brush. Uh, I'm not really a big fan of those um, applicator, but this is a really a good product. So I'm just gonna apply it right, right here, just to kind of give me that chiseled cheeks. So I'm just gonna blend it. You can use a smaller brush if you like, but I just use the same one. It blends really easily. I'm gonna use Kevin Aquan the Sensual Skin Powder Foundation, and this is in the shade Light. PF02. Um, it's it's a pressed powder. It's really nice for the under eyes. It makes them look so bright. So I'm gonna take the same sponge from Real Technique and I'm just gonna apply it underneath the eyes. So I'm just gonna clean my contour. And I'm gonna take a little bit of this underneath the eyes.
So today I'm going to be using two highlighters. I'm going to use Fenty Beauty highlighters. I'm going to use Trophy Wife and I'm also going to use Hustler Baby. So I'm going to do the Hustler Baby first and I'm going to add a little bit more of a yellow uh, goldeny highlight. And I'm going to use this Elf Brush. Uh, this is in the number 105. I really like it for my uh, highlight. So I'm going to go with Hustler Baby first. And I'm just going to keep it right here on the cheekbone. It's a really pretty highlighter. Very intense. And I'm going to use Trophy Wife now with the same brush. And I'm just going to take it a little bit because this is a really, really intense. And then I'm going to take it just right here. And then I'm going to mix them together. But it's mostly like on top. Like that. And then blend them together. Since this is like very subtle highlight, I'm going to take it with a e.l.f. blush brush. I'm going to take it on my chin area. I'm going to take Makeup Forever uh, Pro Bronze Fusion Bronzer and this is in the shade 20M Makeup Forever Bronzer. And I'm just going to set that cream bronzer in place. I'm going to take this palette by uh, Becca Cosmetics and Jaclyn Hill Collaboration. I'm going to take this beautiful pink peachy. It reminds me a lot of Orgasm by NARS. So I'm just going to take it on the apples of my cheeks just for a flush. Just like so. It's They're very pigmented. This is called the Shade and Light Glimmer Eye Contour Palette. This is by Kat Von D. And this has tons of shimmery colors. Really pretty for the summertime. I'm just going to give you a closer look here. They're really, really pretty. And they are very glowy on the lid. So we're going to be using this today. So the first shade I'm going to take is this one here. And just to put it all over the lid. I'm going to take this shade right here. It's really bronzy and beautiful. It has a sheen to it, but I really love these looks for the summertime, like glossy and shimmery colors. So I'm going to take it on a fluffy brush. This is by Sonia Kashuk, and I'm just going to take it on the crease. And I'm not going to be precise with this shade at all. I'm going to be like messy everywhere on the crease. Uh, take this reddish shade. I'm gonna take it and just kind of dab it on the outer corners just right in here I'm gonna use this wet and wild photo focus uh, primer shadow uh, This is really one of my favorite shadow primer from the drugstore. So I'm just gonna put it on the inner third of my eyelid it's a very beautiful shade. I'm going to take this on top of my lid. Now I'm going to take this shade here and I'm going to apply it in the inner corners. so pretty. It's very glowing. I'm going to take this crease shade again and I'm going to pop it in the lower lash line. So this is Waterproof Icole London uh, Carbon Black. This is an eyeliner. It's a pen. I'm going to do a wing liner.
So I just applied some mascara to my lower lashes and I blended the lashes together and I really love the very soft, glamorous look on my eyes. So for lips today, I'm gonna show you two options. Uh, number one is OG Lolita by Kat Von D. I really love this lipstick. So now I'm gonna use Fenty Beauty uh, Stana Lip Paint. This is the shade uh, Uncensored. This is the only lip stain that she had in her line. Um, I really like the formula. It doesn't feel dry on the lips, so I hope she comes out with more colors. This is really pretty. I love it so much. This is one of my favorite. Um, yeah, so this is number two. So this is the finished look guys. I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. Please subscribe for more and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.